Lots of excitement in Hollywood today. The nominations are out for the 96th Annual Academy Awards. It's not just who got the nod, but there's also a lot of buzz about who was overlooked. CBS News correspondent Danya Backus looks at the surprise and the snubs. Congratulations to this year's nominees. Actors Jack Quaid and Zazie Beetz announced the nominations Tuesday, and Christopher Nolan's Oppenheimer led the pack with 13, including Best Picture and Best Director. Why are these men looking at me? The other half of the Barbenheimer phenomenon, Barbie, racked up eight nominations, including Best Picture and a surprise Best Supporting Actress nod for America Ferreira. But filmmaker Greta Gerwig and star Margot Robbie were left out of the Best Director and Best Actress categories. Also competing for Best Picture are American Fiction, Anatomy of a Fall, The Holdovers, Killers of the Flower Moon, Maestro, Past Lives, Poor Things, and The Zone of Interest. For Best Director, Nolan will face off against Martin Scorsese for Killers of the Flower Moon, along with the directors of Anatomy of a Fall, Poor Things, and The Zone of Interest. I mean, you can't. Lily Gladstone made history with her Best Actress nomination for her role in Killers of the Flower Moon. She becomes the first Native American woman to ever be nominated in this category. She'll compete against Annette Bening for Nyad, Sandra Hulier in Anatomy of a Fall, Carrie Mulligan in Maestro, and Emma Stone in Poor Things. You got a nice color scheme. But Glassstone's co-star Leonardo DiCaprio didn't make the cut in the Best Actor category. Instead, the nominations went to Bradley Cooper for Maestro, Coleman Domingo for Rustin, Paul Giamatti for The Holdovers, Oppenheimer's Killian Murphy, and Jeffrey Wright in American Fiction. Danya Backus, CBS News, Los Angeles.